I'm Lark from Wisconsin, Zone 5, and today I'd like to show you how I am having a successful germination rate using the paper towel method. I am going to dampen this paper towel. I took one square. I happen to have the type of paper towel that you can choose a, a smaller square. So I take the large paper towel, fold it in half so it's double thickness, whatever paper towel you use, and I more than dampen it. I actually wet it till it's dripping. Can you see this? It is dripping wet. Then I place it on my counter and I pat it dry. Not real dry, I just pat it that it isn't dripping wet anymore. This way it makes sure that every corner of the paper towel is wet. I am going to start some zucchini, green zucchini here. The <clears throat> zucchini is from 2009. So I marked that on my label. Uh, I'm doing green zucchini and the date today is 419. Now, I don't have too many seeds, but I only need one or two zucchini plants. So, I'm going to put some of these back. I'm only start five. I've had a super, super uh, great success with germinating this way. <clears throat> Probably about 98%. So, I place the, I'm going to do four seeds, onto the dampened paper towel. I fold it over. Then I make sure I seal the edges. I'm just pressing lightly on the edges. I fold my edges over a little, each side, and the top. And I press them down so it's kind of like sticky. Then I slip it into my marked baggie. And I put in the folded side first because I find when I take it out of the baggie, that uh, the seeds don't fall out if I, I hold on to the bottom of the baggie and then pull it out. Then these edges don't come undone. So I put the folded side in first and then seal up the baggie. Now some people don't seal up their baggies completely. They leave a little air in there. I don't. And I tell you, all my seeds have, almost all of them have germinated. Now. I place this baggie on my heat registers. Our heat here in Wisconsin is still clicking in. So wherever you have the uh, warm spot in your house, some people say on top of the fridge, uh, I am putting mine on the register. After a day or two, they germinate, uh, most of the seeds. Now, I'm going to show you, on the 17th, two days ago, I started my uh, Market More uh, cucumbers, and this is the seed. I don't. It's kind of small, so it might get blurry, but uh, you have to be very careful handling these, or you will have the tail come off, and then it's no good. Now, sometimes the tail will grow into the paper towel, and if that happens. Then I take a little of the paper towel with the seed and the tail, and I plant the whole thing. You do not want to rip the tail. So consequently, I have learned not to let these seeds germinate too much. Do not let the tail get too long. On these seeds here, my Blue Lake bush beans, some, only like four or five, have gotten their tails on. The rest have not. So I will pot up these uh, seeds that have the tails on today. And the rest of the seeds will go back into the plastic bag. Fold the paper towel over, make sure it's moist yet, and put it back in the baggie on the heat register. Now these seeds here are my uh, new one, noodle, red noodle bean. And again, not all of them have germinated. So I will pot up the ones that have germinated and put the seeds that have not germinated back into the bag and put it on the heating register. 
Now these beans here are kind of cool. They're uh, a long red noodle, probably about 30 inches, bright, um, I say more reddish purple. And I'm going to be using them in my uh, perennial garden as a pretty ornamental uh, vegetable and over in my vegetable garden. So today I'm going to be potting these things up and starting some new seeds. And it better get warm out pretty soon because uh, my south windows are getting pretty full of seeds. In fact, uh, I'm going to try and show you, and sorry if this is moving too much, but I'm going to show you my germination rate. Whoops, I'm sorry. These are all my seedlings I have started. And uh, my success rate has been super. Now I'm going to do the tripod, so excuse me for a minute here. My tomatoes are doing great. These are my clear totes. I did that video the other day on the clear totes that go out to the uh, deck and get more sunlight. Today it's too cold and it's been snowing out there. But the germination rate is super. I have some flowers, calendula. I'm going to try to be making uh, infusion of calendula this year, so I want to grow a lot of calendula. And then tomatoes of all sizes. So I hope you like this video. Please check out my website, www.larksperennials.com, and let's chat. Tell me about your garden. Thanks for tuning in. Bye-bye.